beauty permeates every corner of our planet. It's akin to a gift meant to enchant the heart. Some places exude a magic worthy of fantasy novels. Even what lies beyond our reach captivates us. From unexplored depths to mountain peaks, today we delve into destinations that amaze. will uncover spots in the world so stunning, it's hard to believe they exist. Iceland Every part of this small country unfolds a natural wonder. Its landscapes combine the bizarre, the majestic, and the beautiful. A land that seems to be alive. immersed in an otherworldly, enigmatic, and mesmerizing atmosphere. It features details reminiscent of imaginary realms. Like Snæfell's Jökull, the volcano housing the entrance to the Earth's core in Jules Verne's novel. Glacial rivers carve through the land, creating breathtaking waterfalls such as Godafoss and Skogafoss. These natural marvels come with a counterpart, the volcanic threat. Iceland is home to about 130 volcanoes, with several dozen active. While nearly a hundred have remained dormant for centuries, Iceland's volcanic activity stems from its location on the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, where the Eurasian and North American plates diverge. Thingvellir National Park showcases the astonishing fractures caused by continental drift. One such fissure is Silfra.
Its exceptionally clear water creates the illusion of floating in the void, allowing divers to swim between two continents. In addition to its mainland, Iceland includes smaller islands. Homes and lighthouses have been built in unimaginable locations. Furthermore, the island transforms into a magnificent stage for the Northern Lights in winter. Norwegian Fjords The nature of Norway is a marvel that awakens awe. a sublime treasure bestowed by Mother Earth. When human structures blend harmoniously with the natural environment, their potential to awe increases. Tradition has it that trolls dwell in these mountains, sometimes visible to the observant. Narrow and steep paths designed for admiring the extraordinary views. Equally spectacular are the numerous fjords adorning Norway's west coast. They are among the most recognizable natural landscapes in the world. Viking sagas often included them in their stories. Formed during the last ice age, glaciers carved deep U-shaped valleys as they moved across the land. As temperatures rose, these areas were flooded by the sea, resulting in the creation of fjords. Hawaii, United States. Deep valleys, waterfalls, and magnificent volcanic formations complete this archipelago. It boasts some of the most graceful coastlines in the world. In Kauai, the terrain is breathtaking. The green peaks contrast with the azure of the ocean. This is the sacred Napoli coast. The vibrant island of Oahu has been the backdrop for dozens of movies and TV shows. mountains and meadows that mirror the Cretaceous era.
we venture into Maui, an ideal location for adventure films. Mountains teeming with greenery are its hallmark. Heavy rainfall and steep cliffs contribute to the creation of Hanakahu Falls. Here, we witness the magnificence of nature. Swiss Alps Majestic mountains, gleaming glaciers, and alpine meadows define them. Spring marks a time of transition and renewal in the Alps. In the lower areas, cattle return to graze outdoors. During winter, a blanket of snow covers peaks and slopes. The Swiss Alps offer unparalleled world-class skiing. The Bernina Express offers one of the most spectacular train journeys in the world. The route includes a series of bridges and tunnels, including the famed Landwasser Viaduct, towering over a deep canyon. From the train's panoramic windows, views of snow-covered villages and mountains unfold. Lotterbrunnen, Switzerland. Among the Swiss Alps, numerous sites are perfect for fantastical story settings. Nestled in a valley, a cozy village seemingly lifted straight from a fairy tale. Lotterbrunnen Valley is encircled by rock faces, giving it an air of seclusion and tranquility. Legend has it that this landscape inspired J.R.R. Tolkien's vision of Rivendell in The Lord of the Rings. One of its sublime features are the waterfalls, earning it the name Valley of 72 Waterfalls. The architecture also captures attention with its traditional design, sloping roofs, and flowered balconies.
Caucasus, Georgia. Several countries share this mountain range, but Georgia stands out for its exceptional scenic beauty. The mountains act as a natural divide between Eastern Europe and Western Asia. They have been a crossroads of culture and witnessed numerous conflicts throughout history. This range is an extension of the Himalayas, formed by the collision of the Arabian and Eurasian plates. In the central area, Villages are isolated, connected only by narrow and perilous paths. Ushkuli, perched at high altitudes near Mount Shikara, ranks among Europe's loftiest settlements. Due to its remote location, its inhabitants have maintained a traditional lifestyle, relying on agriculture and livestock. In spring and summer, the landscape is idyllic and green, with rivers formed by melting snow. However, winters are harsh with heavy snowfall occasionally isolating the village for months. Another symbol of this region, and of Georgia, is the Gurgetti Trinity Church, blending spirituality and nature. It stands on a solitary hill facing Mount Kazbek. Founded in the 14th century, its design reflects the medieval Georgian style. During the winter season, the church and its surroundings are enveloped in a snowy mantle. Dolomites, Italy. In northeast Italy lies this mountain range, the most astonishing section of the Italian Alps. The Dolomites feature breathtaking peaks, deep valleys, and color shifting mountains. Tall rock towers, sharp ridges, and cliffs create an enchanting panorama. Trails gently wind, reflecting the surrounding elegance. Like a human marvel amidst natural wonders, the Church of Santa Magdalena captivates with its unique location. From there, views of the Dolomites' craggy peaks unfold. A short distance away, Lake Bryas 
fills with crystal clear and pure waters. According to myth, its southern end is the gateway to the realm of Farnes, home to the Ladin people, the original inhabitants of this alpine area. Lake Skadar National Park, Montenegro This protected area combines diverse elements, crafting an extraordinary landscape. The Chernoya Vista River meanders through the mountains. The river's intense blue and green hues originate from sedimentation. The reserve centers around Lake Skadar, mostly in Montenegro, stretching into Albanian territory. It's considered one of the main bird sanctuaries in Europe. Faroe Islands, Denmark. An autonomous Danish archipelago in the North Atlantic, between Scotland, Norway, and Iceland. 18 islands, many of them remote with just a handful of residents. Lush green meadows, rolling hills, and steep cliffs dominate the environment. The Faroese maintain a close relationship with nature, adapting to what their surroundings offer. Some villages can only be accessed by sea or through tunnels carved into mountains. Several have been isolated for centuries, bordered by the sea. The climate on these islands is cool, windy, and unpredictable, given their position in the North Atlantic cyclone paths. To shelter from the cold and damp, Traditional houses incorporate grass roofs that provide insulation. Dalmatian Coast, Croatia Among the eastern coast of the Adriatic Sea lies this geographical region. one of the world's most beautiful coastal stretches. Comprising over a thousand islands, many tiny and numerous small seaside towns.
there are also cities, like Dubrovnik, the Pearl of the Adriatic. Medieval walls protect its magnificent historic center. On larger islands, like Brak, we find one of Croatia's most recognized beaches. Zlatni Rat extends like a tongue of sand into the sea. Lofoten Islands, Norway. Nestled within the Arctic Circle, where sharp mountains carve out breathtaking fjords. Narrow and deep valleys are flooded by the sea. Bridges are part of the landscape, essential for local life. Before their construction, the only connection between these enclaves was by sea. Towns like Henningsfair, consisting of small islands, focus on tourism and fishing. To this day, some homes remain accessible only by boat. A unique and intriguing sight is their football field, surrounded by cod drying racks. Coastline of Australia. This nation stands out for its extensive coastline among the longest in the world. Off the northeast coast lies the Great Barrier Reef, the world's largest coral reef system. Whitehaven Beach, a visual symphony of shapes and colors, remains this area's best kept secret. The sand's exceptional purity imparts a radiant color and a texture that remains cool. In Southeast Australia, Port Campbell National Park is part of the famed Great Ocean Road. Rising from the ocean, the Twelve Apostles loom from the ocean depths. Toward the central southern area, the Great Australian Bight unveils a captivating shoreline.
Here lies the Great Southern Reef, a system of interconnected reefs. Beneath the surface of these waters lies a marvelous world, filled with species as rare as they are beautiful. The giant cuttlefish is a master of camouflage, with a bewildering ability to change its color and texture. The common sea dragon illustrates the marine world's oddities. It has protrusions that mimic the look of seaweed or grass, allowing it to blend into the underwater flora. Equally peculiar is the enigmatic leafy sea dragon. Its leaf-like appendages are more prominent, giving it a bushy appearance. During mating season, females transfer eggs to males, who incubate them in a special area under their tail until they hatch. Yangshuo, China. This landscape mirrors scenes from traditional Chinese paintings. Karst formations rise abruptly from the land and water. Here, Chinese agricultural life is on display, with rice fields, water buffaloes, and typical boats. A unique tradition here is cormorant fishing. Fishermen train the bird to assist in catching fish. Once released, they swim and dive to catch prey which are later collected. Reunion Island, France. This is one of France's outermost regions. Located in the Indian Ocean, east of Madagascar. It boasts various peaks including Piton de la Fourne, one of the world's most active volcanoes. The island is covered in dense tropical jungles.
elevated areas of reunion, experience among the most intense rainfall on Earth. This, coupled with the rugged terrain, creates optimal conditions for waterfalls that plunge from great heights. Alaska, United States. It's a place of wild nature. Given its massive and sometimes inaccessible terrain, a special relationship with bush plains has formed. These aircraft have become a crucial aspect of life in this state. In many remote areas, they are the only means of transportation. Alaska is home to some of the highest mountains on the continent, including Denali. This territory's landscape dramatically varies across regions. Dense forests, lakes, and waterfalls dominate the south and southeast. Here, the Gulf of Alaska is surrounded by glaciers. The coast is lengthy and intricate, with numerous fjords. In its waters, a breathtaking spectacle unfolds. Whales gather opening their massive mouths to feed. To the north, the landscape is defined by tundra and icy plains. Thousands of glaciers exist in Alaska, though only a few hundred have been named. In fact, there are more glaciers here than in the rest of the United States combined. Among its national parks, Katmai fascinates with its high concentration of brown bears. This reserve has one of the highest densities of these mammals in the world. The best time to see them is during the summer.
especially at Brooks Falls, where they can gather to fish for salmon, waiting patiently to catch them. Northern Vietnam Far removed from North America, with an opposite climate and distinct landscapes, yet equally beautiful. Rice terraces form steps along the mountain slopes. cultivated for centuries by successive generations within the same communities. Water is collected from higher sources and efficiently distributed across the terraced surfaces. Their color changes with the seasons, turning greener during the maturation process. Heading to higher areas, we reach Pansapan. Known as the Roof of Indochina, it's the highest peak in Vietnam, Laos, and Cambodia. Ecuador Amazon Rainforest The western basin of the Amazon radiates tropical enchantment. Here lies Reventador, one of the most active volcanoes in the Americas, surrounded by jungle. Each eruption reshapes its cone and blankets the surrounding area with ash. This Amazon area is a hotspot of animal beauty. Its inaccessibility has kept it largely untouched by human activity. And if one looks carefully, it's possible to encounter strange beings. Hundreds of unique and beautiful animal species inhabit here. Exploring these jungles feels like a journey back through time. Onycophorans have existed for about 500 million years. Many insects have developed unique adaptations to survive. Camouflage stands as one of the most astonishing defensive mechanisms. This cricket of the genus Orophus mimics so effectively it blends with a leaf.
On the other hand, this caterpillar of the genus Papilium doesn't look too appetizing. It has evolved to resemble bird droppings. Even more incredible is this caterpillar. Emeroplanus tryptolemus. To deter predators, it mimics a venomous snake in appearance and movement. At the end of its body are two spots that look like eyes, but it's an illusion. When walking, one must be careful, as some moths are not easy to see. Titai tamerlan resembles a dry leaf with irregular edges. And it's not just insects. The patu's plumage masterfully blends with the forest's textures and colors. To hide, it adopts a rigid posture, elongating its body, blending with the tree trunk where it perches. Tara River, Montenegro This river is considered to have the deepest canyon in Europe and the second deepest in the world, after the Grand Canyon in the United States. The Tara River flows through Montenegro to Bosnia and Herzegovina. It's a popular spot for rafting enthusiasts. Spanning the Tara River, the Durdavika Tara Bridge is among Europe's tallest. Another beautiful site in Montenegro is located to the south, the artificial Lake Piva. An engineered marvel, it's among the deepest European lakes. Mount Yoshino, Japan Renowned as one of the country's premier destinations for viewing cherry blossoms, the mountains are awash in shades of pink, red, and green, thanks to the abundant flowering of thousands of trees. The peak viewing period for the cherry blossoms is extended due to the wide variety of cherry tree species in bloom. For generations, this mountain has been a pilgrimage destination in the practice of Shugendo, an ancient Japanese religion that blends elements of Shinto and Buddhism.
Raja Ampat, Indonesia. This archipelago consists of about 1,500 small islands, caves, and sandbanks. Land and water merge to create a magical symphony. The islands, with their rugged terrain, are cloaked in tropical vegetation. Among these forests dwell some unusual mammals, like the spotted couscous. However, the most astonishing surprises await underwater. Raja Ampat is a hotspot of marine biodiversity. Over 70% of the known coral species inhabit this location. Located within the Coral Triangle, its position between the Indian and Pacific Oceans explains the profuse marine life. The volume and speed of water ensure that nutrients and millions of eggs are transported through the area. This abundance of food supports the thriving of hundreds of species. Not just on the surface, but also in seagrass meadows and deep waters. It's in these settings where creatures take on forms that surpass human imagination. Berchtesgaden National Park, Germany. The only protected area in the German Alps. Berchtesgaden, known for its traditional Bavarian houses, is the gateway to the park. The Church of St. Sebastian stands out as a specimen of Baroque architecture. At the park's heart, the long and narrow Konisi Lake is framed by high peaks, with temples along its shores. Adjacent to it, Lake Obersee exudes a sense of tranquility and serenity. Xinjiang, China. Stretching across northwest China, this region showcases intense colors and diverse topography. This land composes over one sixth of mainland China's territory. It 
played a crucial role in the Silk Road, the ancient trade network connecting China with the Middle East, Africa, and Europe. In the north, near Lake Kanas, wide carnivorous forests are seen. In Baying Golin and Li Kazik, the grasslands are vital for agriculture and livestock. Antalya Caves, Turkey In this region of southern Turkey, you'll find beaches of exceptional Mediterranean beauty. The Ka Songclave, with its underwater caves, is a point of interest for diving enthusiasts. Entering through these narrow passages feels like stepping into another dimension. These realms remain largely uncharted. In some areas, the smooth walls might suggest they are remnants of ancient civilizations. However, the prevailing opinion is that they are natural land formations. created over thousands of years by geological processes. The play of light inside the caves, especially at certain times of day, creates striking visual effects. Karachi, Brazil. It embodies a wonderful blend of natural charm and historical heritage. Situated between the sea and the Serra do Mar Mountains, this town presents a harmonious mix of vegetation and architecture. Karachi's historic center, exceptionally well-preserved, showcases 17th and 18th century colonial architecture. During the Brazilian gold rush, it served as a pivotal port. The coast includes dozens of islands, ranging from bustling spots to secluded paradises accessible only by boat. Ilulisant Icefjord, Greenland A 
a broad and cold expanse adorned with icebergs. Many of the gigantic icebergs that roam the oceans start here. The Sermek Kuyalik glacier flows into the sea, releasing icebergs daily. Some so tall and vast that they remain trapped in shallow waters for years. Due to wind and water erosion, they can take on peculiar shapes during this time. In some cases, they form geometric patterns. As they break off, smaller icebergs travel to the North Atlantic and then southward until they melt. Despite these extreme conditions, wildlife such as humpback whales and fin whales can still be observed. Petit Valley, India. It is renowned for its towering massifs among the country's highest. The trails winding along the mountain slopes are extremely narrow. Crossing them leads to this Petit Valley, an area defined by its arid terrain, offering a profound sense of seclusion and serenity. It remains a vital hub of Tibetan Buddhism, with temples that seem designed to admire the horizon. The key monastery is a significant religious center. A short walk away, the Chicham Bridge, one of Asia's highest, offers dizzying views across a deep canyon. Pasu Kones, Pakistan. The landscapes of Pakistan are unforgettable. Paths graze the edges of deep cliffs. In the north of the country, the Pasu Kones stands out, a group of jagged peaks, part of the Karakoram Range.
they bear resemblance to the spires or towers of a cathedral. Set against a backdrop of both glacial and river valleys. The mountains reach almost unimaginable heights. The area contains four of the world's 14 highest peaks, known as the Eight Thousanders, including K2. Furthermore, this mountain range is home to some of the longest non-polar glaciers known as the Third Pole. Himalayas of Nepal Where Earth meets sky, they stand not just as geological marvels, but also spiritual sanctuaries. Spanning across Nepal, the Himalayas resemble slumbering giants. This region is home to rugged mountains, snowy valleys, and alpine lakes. Dominating the central area, the Annapurna Range, hosts a natural park. It's an area particularly prone to avalanches. Beyond the snow, there are dry zones at considerable altitudes. Following paths alongside ravines leads to isolated communities. Like Manong, a whisper of life with just a few souls cradled by towering peaks. Kamchatka, Russia Removed from the hustle and bustle, this peninsula juts out into Russia's Far East. A primal world where nature reigns supreme, untouched by modernity. A hidden gem at the Earth's edge, where roads are scarce and access challenges even the most intrepid traveler. Its remoteness and daunting terrain make it one of Russia's final frontiers. Volcanic and mountainous landscapes intertwine. Home to hundreds of volcanoes, though only a select few are active. They belong to the Pacific Ring of Fire, where 90% of the world's seismic activity is concentrated.
Mutnovsky, stands out as a dynamic volcano. It consists of four stratovolcanoes stacked atop each other, each marked by unique features. Geothermal activity breathes life into the landscape, marked by steaming fumaroles. Kamchatka is also noted for its dense population of brown bears. They occasionally gallop across the moist fields. Among the largest of their kind on the planet, thanks to the abundant food available in their ecosystem. During the salmon run, it's common to see them in rivers, offering captivating glimpses into the animal kingdom. Santorini, Greece In the Aegean Sea, this island of unique charm is adorned with white and blue buildings. Ia, one of Santorini's towns, is world-renowned for its unforgettable sunsets. To ascend, a series of steps lead up from the village of Amudi. Houses are built into the cliffs. Originally homes for fishermen, these dwellings are now sought after for their charm and ocean views. Walking these labyrinthine streets is like stepping into a living postcard. Adorned with quaint shops, they create a serene atmosphere. The blend of gleaming white houses against the deep blue of the Aegean creates an unforgettable image. Azores, Portugal In the expansive waters of the Atlantic Ocean emerges this archipelago, a Portuguese gem. Colonization began in 1420 when they were discovered by explorers. Their volcanic origins gift the Azores with a landscape of mountainous terrain, featuring craters and lagoons. Life here is serene, a stark contrast to the hustle and bustle of Portugal's major cities. The mild climate, coupled with plentiful rainfall, fosters dense vegetation and the formation of numerous waterfalls.
The islands boast lush green pastures, complemented by cliffs and narrow beaches. Antarctica The planet Earth's final frontier, a continent shrouded in mystery. Scientists and adventurers must travel vast distances to reach it. Massive blocks of ice amaze with their enormity and distinctive shapes. The tabular icebergs with their flat sides evoke natural architectural designs. Arrival to these frozen lands has been primarily facilitated through the use of icebreakers. They navigate what seems to be channels carved into the ice. These sturdy ships are designed to traverse frozen waters. But in recent times, flights from countries like Chile have also been implemented. They land on icy runways, where biting cold and fierce winds are the greeting. Upon arrival, the fortunate witness some of the most extraordinary creatures of our world. Life in Antarctica has mastered the art of survival under extreme conditions. Showcasing the resilience and adaptability of nature. The breeding and nurturing habits of these species reflect life's determination. Machu Picchu, Peru. Perched in the heights of the Peruvian Andes, it stands as an ancient Inca stronghold. Enveloped in clouds, surrounded by green mountains, it appears as a city frozen in a bygone era. Some theories suggest it was a royal retreat, a ceremonial center, or an urban settlement. Its appearance and architecture are simply astounding. The finely carved stone structures, perfectly interlocked, have withstood the ravages of time.
The urban design reflects the Inca's technical skill and worldview, with precise alignment to astronomical events. Its winding paths and structures, with abysses on either side, form a mosaic that portrays the daily life of the Incas. Bali, Indonesia The eastern Indonesian islands emerge as true earthly paradises. Known as the Islands of the Gods, Bali draws travelers from around the globe with its spiritual ambience. One experiences a deep connection with natural elements. The rice terraces that adorn the island maintain the practices of ancient Balinese agriculture. They use the Subak, a system of waterworks in use for over a thousand years. Sacred volcanoes define Bali's mountainous terrain. At the southern tip of the island, the Uluwatu Temple is perched atop a cliff, overlooking the Indian Ocean. Exploring underwater depths unveil new facets of this area's earthly splendor. With species like the striated frogfish, Antenarius striatus, it has a fleshy appendage on top of its head that it uses as a lure to attract prey. Metasepia fafuri or flamboyant cuttlefish, can rapidly change color. While it has the ability to swim, it's commonly seen walking in search of food. Another mesmerizing creature of Balinese waters is the ghost pipefish, Solenostomos paradoxus. Sometimes it remains motionless or moves slowly, mimicking the movement of algae with the current. British Columbia, Canada. The westernmost Canadian province, 
among the last areas of the Americas to be explored. Its gigantic size is comparable to that of France, Germany, and the Netherlands combined. Marked by multiple mountain systems, including the Rocky Mountains, It features an extensive coastline with fjords set against towering elevations. And dense coniferous forests with crystal clear lakes. The ecosystem supports diverse wildlife, including moose, otters, and bald eagles. Chiapa, Mexico Natural beauty and cultural richness intertwine in this jungle-clad Mexican state. Jungles, forests, and mangroves cover a broad section of the territory. The high volume of rainfall contributes to the formation of numerous waterfalls. The Sumadero Canyon, formed by tectonic movements, tower above the Grijalva River. To the south, bordering Guatemala, the Lagunas del Montebello National Park showcases dozens of lakes with bluish-green hues. The region boasts a mild climate and constant gentle humidity. Pines and oaks cover the area, creating a picturesque landscape. Canary Islands, Spain The Atlantic hosts an archipelago featuring beaches, large dunes, mountains, ancient forests, and volcanoes. Providing a pleasant climate year-round. Tenerife, one of the seven Canary Islands, boasts a volcanic landscape. Mount Teta, an active volcano and Spain's highest peak, dominates the area. Its surface resembles the moon, casting reddish hues at sunset.
In Tenerife's northeast, the Anaga mountain range is home to laurel forests, nurtured by the trade winds. In the south of Grand Canary Island, the Mas Palomas Dunes border a long beach. La Palma, the second highest island after Tenerife, features terrains shaped by geological processes and lush forests. Exploring a submerged cemetery is a unique experience on this island. In 1999, dozens of stone crosses were sunk in memory of Jesuit priests killed in the 16th century by French pirates. Meanwhile, Puerta Ventura is known for its extensive white sandy beaches. With an arid climate and sparse vegetation, it resembles a desert. Galapagos Islands, Ecuador. Off the coast of Ecuador, the Galapagos Islands serve as a naturalist's dream, a living laboratory of evolution. This archipelago is marked by volcanic landscapes, including craters and solidified lava flows. With white and black sandy beaches and crystal clear blue waters. It stands out as one of the most notable examples of Earth's animal beauty. Playful sea lions are a constant presence on the beaches. Marine iguanas bask on the rocky shores. They are the only iguanas in the world adapted to aquatic life. The Galapagos hosts a rare colony of penguins. The only ones found north of the equator. Another unique animal is the flightless cormorant. It is adapted to marine life, 
losing its ability to fly. We can't leave these islands without mentioning the famous giant tortoises. They are the largest species of land turtle, some living over 100 years. Zermatt, Switzerland A renowned resort nestled in the Swiss Alps. It is celebrated for its pristine condition. From the village, the Matterhorn, with its pyramidal shape, challenges mountaineers. Until the mid-19th century, it was an agricultural community. However, the influx of tourists has transformed it into a winter sports hub. The Gornergrat Railway, skirted by ski slopes, ranks among Europe's highest cogwheel trains. It provides visitors unique access to stunning views of glaciers. Banff National Park, Canada. Home to the enchanting Moraine Lake, famed for its sublime beauty. Likewise, Lake Louise. The color of both comes from rock flower carried by waters from adjacent glaciers. This reserve is the country's first national park. Nestled in the heart of the Canadian Rockies. Banff stands out among the locales, a tourist destination in its own right due to its alpine charm. Amalfi Coast, Italy. This coast on Italy's southern shores appears as if lifted from a painting. Slopes meet the Tyrrhenian Sea, creating a striking contrast with the deep blue waters. Narrow roads wind along the seafront, offering panoramic views at every turn. Colorful towns and villas perch on these natural cliffs. Homes are perched just steps from the sea.
with narrow streets leading down to the shore. The town of Amalfi was one of Italy's four maritime republics, a powerful trading state during the Middle Ages. Another unique spot on the Amalfi coast is the Fioro di Fiorore. Though called a fjord, it's actually a small river gorge. Inside, some houses seem hidden from the outside world. and a small beach awaits summer enjoyment. Yosemite National Park, United States. Over the ages, glacial movements have sculpted this magnificent valley leaving behind cliffs and granite structures. This haven is home to century-old beings, the giant sequoias. Over 500 of these immense trees reside in Mariposa Grove. Next to these giants, people seem like mere ants. Other wonders of Yosemite include its waterfalls which inspire awe. Ribbon Fall is one of the longest waterfalls in North America. It cascades from the western side of El Capitan, a colossal granite monolith, a favorite challenge for climbers. Micronesia Within the global divisions, this subregion encompasses microstates, like Palau, Kiribati, the Marshall Islands, and the Federated States of Micronesia. These island nations feature atolls, coral structures encircling tranquil lagoons, Among them is Kiras Mea, one of the world's largest. Micronesia beckons global divers as one of their most coveted destinations. 
curious mollusks like the Nautilus, virtually unchanged for millions of years, are observed here. associated with submarines and the mysteries of ocean's abyssal zones. Chuck Lagoon, one of the four states of the Federated States of Micronesia, is known for its underwater World War II relics. It ranks among the world's largest underwater graveyards, a spectacle visible from above. Dozens of ships and hundreds of World War II planes are scattered across the seabed. Palau's German Channel emerges as another sensational diving spot. It acts as a cleaning sanctuary for manta rays, with tiny fish devoted to their grooming. Gardens and Aqueducts of the Netherlands Nature's hand joins with human ingenuity to weave a tapestry of natural beauty and engineering marvels. Kuchenhof is hailed as the Garden of Europe. The land provides fertile soil, ideal for cultivating tulips. The Netherlands' name reflects its unique geographic identity, with a significant portion of the land below sea level. As a result, aqueducts and multiple structures have been erected throughout the country. For generations, its people have undertaken grand projects to reclaim the land. Meteora, Greece A surreal and spiritual blend of architectural genius with rocky masses. Orthodox temples, perch atop a Met's sandstone pinnacles. Originally, there were 24 monasteries, but today, only six remain active. They merge with the rock so seamlessly, it seems as though they were carved directly from it. Initially, access was only possible via ladders. Now, 
Some boast the convenience of small cable cars. Hokkaido, Japan Japan's northernmost island, a haven of pristine nature and pronounced seasonal shifts. It boasts the lowest population density in the archipelago. Summers are short and cool, while winters are long and cold, marked by heavy snowfall. Hokkaido shelters unique wildlife, such as the Sika deer, Ezo flying squirrel, and Manchurian crane. Volcanic activity accounts for its numerous hot springs. Whooper swans flock to these springs, basking in the comforting warmth. Klitvice Lakes, Croatia Sixteen terraced bodies of water, linked by waterfalls in a forested valley. Separated by natural travertine barriers, a type of sedimentary rock. These lakes are a cascade of colors, from dark blue to emerald green. Saint Bialis, France Perched in the majestic high Pyrenees, skirting the Spanish border's edge, The Garonne River winds its way gracefully through the mountains, adding beauty to the landscape. The town's citadel is notably well-preserved among French medieval fortifications. The castle dates back to the 12th century, with a chapel added in the 19th. Strategically located on a rock outcrop, it has been a key defensive point for generations. Bonifacio, France Cradled by the Mediterranean's crystal waters, this coastal town rises at Corsica's southern tip. Its position atop limestone cliffs is breathtaking.
the old town's medieval charm remains untouched. There's also a protected natural harbor, historically used for trade and military purposes. Mauritius Sailing the Indian Ocean unveils an oasis of lush vegetation. It features both volcanic mountains and dense forests. As a tropical island, it's an ideal marine setting for dazzling natural events. During monsoons, heavy rains feed streams flowing into the ocean. Fresh water forms a layer on top of the denser salt water, resulting in a less salty surface. Yet, Mauritius holds more wonders. At the island's southwest peninsula, Morne Brabant showcases an unusual natural phenomenon. The so-called underwater waterfalls. However, it's simply an optical illusion created by a lengthy erosion process. The continental shelf plunges into an abyss, dragging along blankets of sediment. Aoraki, Mount Cook National Park, New Zealand. Rock, ice, and profound silence dominate. An oasis of untamed natural beauty, accentuated by imposing alpine mountains. The reserve's highest peak is Mount Cook, or Aoraki. According to Maori legend, Aoraki is a celestial youth turned into a mountain when his canoe capsized in the heavens. This park served as a training ground for mountaineers like Sir Edmund Hillary, who prepared here before his Everest ascent. Fjordland National Park, New Zealand Glaciers sculpted these fjords during the last ice age, around 100,000 years ago. Milford Sound is a standout location due to its unusually high levels of rainfall.
enveloped by rugged cliffs that plunge into the water. The frequent rains give birth to numerous waterfalls, as if the mountains were shedding their tears. Some are continuous, while others re-emerge after the downpours. Lake Garda, Italy Italy's largest lake, a tourist hotspot in the north. Among the small islands in its waters, Garda Island is distinguished by its picturesque garden and villa. Despite its northern location, the lake enjoys an almost Mediterranean microclimate. The surrounding area has been inhabited since prehistoric times. In the Middle Ages, it was of strategic importance. In the lake south, the town of Sermion extends into a peninsula. Scaliger Castle is an unusual relic, a rare example of medieval port fortification. Sichuan, China A Chinese province stretching over part of the Tibetan Plateau. A land of fertile plains and towering mountains. It is one of the birthplaces of Chinese tea culture. The colorful multi-tiered waterfalls are part of the Zhou Jai Go National Park. The crystal clear waters offer a clear view of the lake bottoms. Not far to the south lies Yanjin, dubbed the world's narrowest city. Cliffs of Moar, Ireland A showcase of cliffs, caves, and varied geological features. They began forming around 300 million years ago. Like a natural wall shielding from the Atlantic Ocean, It has been a tourist spot for nearly 200 years. 
initially visited by the Victorian English. To the south, other cliffs are revealed at Loop Head. They may not be as tall as Moors, but they are equally formidable. Lake Bled, Slovenia A sculptural gem in the Julian Alps. Encircled by a glacial valley, its waters shimmer with an intense blue. The heart of Lake Bled beats on its central island, crowned by the serene church of the Assumption. A dream wedding venue, with a tradition requiring the groom to carry his bride-to-be up the church's 99 steps. The lake is overseen by Bled Castle from a nearby rocky peak, a fortress overseeing over a thousand years of Slovenian history. Chamonix, France Emerging from the Alpine Heights, this French village boasts a unique mountain charm. Its pedestrian streets are adorned with traditional architecture, wooden houses, and pitched roofs. Guarded by Mont Blanc and other European giants. A perfect sanctuary for winter sports enthusiasts. Ascending into the clouds, the Aguil du Midi cable car offers unforgettable panoramic views. Verdun Gorge, France Carved by nature, this canyon stands as a natural masterpiece. Patiently sculpted by the Verdun River over millennia, Flowing between towering rock walls, the gorge carves deep into the mountain's heart. At its western end, the artificial lake, Lake St. Croix, nestles in peaceful repose. Maldives Shimmering in the Indian Ocean, the Maldives unfold as a true tropical paradise. The 
world's flattest nation. Comprising around 1,100 coral islands, with only a few inhabited. Mali, its capital, is among the world's smallest. Visitors often take seaplanes or speedboats from Mali International Airport to reach the tourist islands. There, luxurious bungalows and villas perch on stilts over the crystal clear waters. Cathedral Beach, Spain. Named for its natural stone arches and vaults. Wind and water have meticulously sculpted these structures over countless natural cycles. The beach is fully accessible, only at low tide. Allowing visitors to wander among the caves and rocks. Lavatnet Lake, Norway. These charming rivers, winding through southern Norway, are only overshadowed by the nearby majestic lakes. Lavatnet, known for its turquoise waters and tranquil atmosphere, is nestled in a mountainous valley. For millennia, nearby glaciers have sculpted the landscape. The water's unique hue comes from the fine sediments that flow into the lake. Close by and less explored, Moldovatnet Lake is another testament to Scandinavian natural beauty. The crystal clear waters capture the silhouettes of mountains and the serenity of the blue sky. Torres del Paine National Park, Chile. Nestled in Patagonia, pristine South American wilderness. The Torres del Paine, three granite peaks, steal the spotlight. The park conceals several glaciers with the famous Grey Glacier among them.
pumas, elusive creatures. Enjoy one of their last sanctuaries here. Guanacos are more commonly seen. They roam freely, adapted to the rugged terrain and changing climate. Isle of Sky, Scotland. From Old Norse, Sky translates to Island of the Clouds. A fitting name, indeed. Sheep are an integral part of the scenery, wandering free near the cliffs. Its mysterious and wild appearance have made it a filming location for several movies. The old man of store could belong to an alien planet. Legend says it's a petrified giant. The weather is unpredictable, with the potential to experience all four seasons in a single day. Bora Bora, France A genuine tropical Eden, a slice of paradise in French Polynesia. At its heart rise two extinct peaks of an ancient volcano, Mount Otamanu and Mount Paya. This atoll boasts a unique shape, encircled by a coral reef and several small islands known as Motus. Wrapped in the embrace of the coral reef, its waters are serene. Thanks to this natural barrier, a pristine marine ecosystem thrives. Exclusive villas and bungalows are quintessential to the experience. Tonga A cluster of over 170 islands, many retaining their untouched state. Here, white sands blend with coral reefs and underwater volcanoes. At times, a curious segregation of elements is evident. In these oceanic fissures, animal and plant species find sanctuary. Yet, the most awe-inspiring are the whale sightings.
up-close encounters are possible under the guidance of seasoned experts. Iguazu Falls, Brazil and Argentina Straddling borders, these falls unveil their grandeur, mostly in Argentina, while Brazil hosts a smaller portion. It's said that Brazil offers the view, and Argentina, the experience. Encompassing around 275 waterfalls, varying with rain levels. The water takes a stunning plunge into the narrow devil's throat. Its force is such that the roar echoes in the distance and mist looms over the jungle. Red Sea Beginning at the Gulf of Suez near Egypt and ending at the Bab al-Mandeb Strait, close to Yemen. The Red Sea is home to over a thousand fish species and hundreds of hard and soft corals. Warm waters, exceptional visibility, and rich marine biodiversity make it a top diving destination. Feather stars or crinoids draw the eye. Some species are mobile, using their arms to walk along the seabed. Others, such as the dugong, may be found feeding in the seagrass. The dugong are creatures of solitude, reserved and elusive. Due to their high sensitivity to pollution, they are considered indicators of marine ecosystem health. Austrian Alps the eastern part of the Alps. Covering about 60% of Austria's land surface. Scattered across valleys are villages with wooden houses and Baroque churches. Alpine roads and lakes sit at astonishing elevations. A hallmark of this alpine region are the orographic clouds.
dense fog that spreads across the mountain slopes. Occasionally shrouded in clouds, one of the world's most beautiful villages is Hallstatt. Until the 19th century, it was only accessible by boat or narrow paths. Now, connected by road to the outside world, it still retains its tranquil and secluded feel. Wooden houses adorned with flowers harmoniously blend with the natural landscape. Surrounded by mountains belonging to the Dockstein Massif, El Nido, Philippines Renowned as a tourist haven at the northern tip of Palawan Island, home to some of the world's most stunning beaches. El Nido refers to the edible nests of swiftlets found in the area's cliffs. These sculpted rocks resemble the bays of nearby countries like Thailand or Vietnam. Twin Lagoon, with its two bodies of water separated by a massive cliff, is a highlight. Japanese Alps Three mountain ranges crossing the heart of Honshu. Japan's main island. Divided into the northern, Hida, central, Kiso, and southern, Akaishi, Alps. Several peaks are deemed sacred in Shintoism and Buddhism. Towns like Shirakawago emerge among them. In the north lies Kamikochi, an alpine valley with sky-blue rivers. It serves as a gateway to the Alps, where explorers' journeys and climbers' ascents begin. Capri, Italy Stone guardians rise above the Tyrrhenian Sea on this island.
artists have fallen for its blooming gardens. A tranquil retreat for the Roman emperors like Augustus and Tiberius. Roads trace the edges of deep cliffs. And luxurious homes occupy exceptional spots. Bryce Canyon National Park, United States. Named after Ebenezer Bryce, a Mormon pioneer who settled in the area in the 1870s. The human history of this reserve dates back at least 10,000 years, with Paleo-Indians and subsequent Native American groups. Hoodoo's irregularly shaped rock columns stand as natural sculptures in the landscape. Niagara Falls, Canada and United States On the border between both countries lies this natural wonder. One of the planet's most formidable creations. The turbulent waters produce a thick mist that, with sunlight, often triggers rainbow formations. Formed by retreating glaciers, they've undergone transformation over several millennia. It is comprised of three waterfalls. The American Falls and Bridal Veil vale Falls are on U.S. territory. Horseshoe Falls, the largest, spans a small portion in the U.S. and most in Canadian territory. Veng Ving, Laos Karst formations encircle this town. Initially a quiet village, it evolved into a backpacker's paradise. The cliffs are not only beautiful, but also hold significant archaeological and historical value. Victoria Falls, Zambia and Zimbabwe
the Zambezi River plunges into a gorge to create a natural marvel. Locally known as Mozio Atunya, meaning the smoke that thunders. At Devil's Pool, one witnesses the water's fall at the abyss's edge. The generated mist and spray create an environment that feels like perpetual rain. Kokora Valley, Colombia The heart of Colombia's coffee triangle is more than just a coffee growing area. Part of the Andes, it features mountainous terrain. The wax palms, Colombia's national tree, are among the tallest in the world. With the morning and evening chill, they're enveloped in a thick mist. Los Lagos, Chile This southern Chilean region is known for lakes like Xiangquie. Encircled by dense forests, the lagoons have taken on unusual shapes. Volcanoes like Orzono stand out in the landscape. Vijarica, with its snow-capped summit, is among Chile's most active. To the south, the Petroe River flows with rapids from Lake Todos Los Santos. Trang An, Vietnam This rugged terrain has caught the eye of major film productions. Rivers meander through expansive rice paddies. Small boats offer close-up views of the karst towers. Caves connected by underground rivers are revealed. A few are spacious enough to be explored. Upon exiting the caves, visitors find paths that lead to temples, nestled among the mountains and valleys.
Canema National Park, Venezuela. Its vastness rivals countries like Belgium. Home to the Paymon, an indigenous people who have lived in this reserve for centuries. Part of this conservation area is covered by the Grand Sabana, dotted with tepui. The most famous is Rorema, one of the world's most astonishing geological formations. Its flat top and vertical walls are awe-inspiring. The world's highest waterfall, Angel Falls, cascades from another tepui, Ayan Tepui. It emerges from the clouds, creating an ethereal mist as it strikes the rocks. Phong Nha Ke Bong National Park, Vietnam Home to some of the Earth's most magnificent caves. Phong Nha River Cave is estimated to be around 400 million years old. Its entrance resembles the gateway to an enchanted realm. Over countless ages, unique limestone rocks have formed inside. Sandung Cave is also here, deemed one of the world's largest caves. Although discovered by a local in 1991, it didn't attract explorers until 2009. Ceiling collapses in the cave allow sunlight in, fostering the growth of green areas. Cappadocia, Turkey Inhabited since the Bronze Age, it's a land of kingdoms, Roman provinces, and Byzantine territories. Residents carved churches, homes, and monasteries into the soft volcanic rocks. Fairy chimneys were formed from volcanic eruptions. It's intriguing that so many civilizations have witnessed this unusual landscape over the centuries. In ancient times, Cappadocia was a vital point on the Silk Road, with inns for travelers to rest and replenish.
Lake Como, Italy. Italy's third largest lake and one of Europe's deepest. A leisure spot since ancient Roman times. Many villas bear remnants of architecture and heritage from that era. A retreat for aristocrats and the wealthy. Villa del Balbeanello is notable having appeared in several films. Bay of Kotor, Montenegro Often described as Europe's southernmost fjord, it is actually a submerged river canyon. Various cultures have left their mark here, including Roman, Byzantine, and Venetian influences. During the Venetian Republic era, it served as a base for a renowned naval fleet. The city of Kotor is protected by medieval fortifications. At the foot of St. Elias Hill, Paris boasts its Baroque architecture. Off its coast lie two notable islands. Our Lady of the Rocks, man-made with a quaint church. While St. George is natural, home to a Benedictine monastery. Gietorn, Netherlands It has earned the nickname Venice of the Netherlands. No roads just a network of canals and arched bridges. Boats glide through the water as the primary mode of transport. A sequence of homes sits directly over the canals. Many are perched on tiny private islands with their own docks. Lençóis Maranhenses National Park, Brazil Despite its desert-like appearance, it receives high annual rainfall. Sand dunes rise to great heights, constantly shaped by the wind.
crystal clear lagoons form during the rainy season. Some have shallow areas where one can walk. In others, people swim as if at a beach. Tumpak Sewu, Indonesia Unlike typical waterfalls, this one is semicircular in shape. With a tiered flow creating a dramatic visual effect as water cascades over multiple levels. Lush vegetation makes it feel like a hidden space. Located in a highly volcanic area at the foot of Mount Semeru. Tianmen Mountain National Forest Park, China. A visual symphony where nature and architecture merge in a magically serene corner. The winding road of 99 bends leads to Tianmen Mountain's summit, symbolizing the emperor with the number 9. Thus, this path represents a heavenly journey. The adventure culminates at Heaven's Gate, which requires climbing 999 steps to conquer. Mont Saint Michel, France. A rocky island in Normandy that has enchanted visitors from around the globe. Said to have inspired J.R.R. Tolkien's creation of Minas Tirith in The Lord of the Rings. Atop sits a Benedictine abbey. Its streets are narrow, cobblestoned, and maze-like, designed in the Middle Ages. During high tide, the surrounding waters rise quickly, historically providing a natural defense against invaders. Skellig Michael, Ireland Off Ireland's southwest coast, this island bravely defies the ocean's forces. Its location, separated from Ireland by often turbulent waters, has allowed for excellent preservation. Climbing hundreds of stone steps leads to one of the world's most remote Christian monasteries.
monks built huts for aesthetic living. Puffin nesting on the towering cliffs enhances the surrounding view. Petra, Jordan Access to this ancient city, the capital of the Nabataean Kingdom, is through the Seek, a narrow gorge. It stands as one of the world's archaeological wonders, nestled between canyons and desert mountains. Carved into the rock itself, it seems part of a sculpted masterpiece. Pamukkale, Turkey The unique shape of these terraces results from the accumulation of calcium carbonate from underground waters. Its name, translating to Cotton Castle, captures its appearance with layers resembling solidified clouds. They hold thermal waters, creating natural mirrors that reflect the sky. For centuries, the healing properties of its springs have been firmly believed in. Tianzi Mountain, China Peaks gently descending into a misty lake. Located in Jiangjiajie National Forest Park, this mountain is filled with extraordinary stone pillars. The sandstone columns appear as rocks suspended in midair. Each one has a distinct shape. Formed by prolonged erosion, winter freezing, and vegetable growth in warmer times. Ha Long Bay, Vietnam Legend has it that a dragon created it by diving into the sea to defend Vietnam. The bay consists of about 1,600 islands and islets. With pillars taking on strange shapes. Sometimes lagoons are formed between the islands. In other areas, large caves beckon exploration. P. 
Hung Na Bay, Thailand. Countless karst formations dominate this seascape. Life has sprung forth on them, giving rise to lush forests. Local inhabitants live in floating villages, maintaining an ancestral lifestyle focused on fishing. Mangroves are crucial for the habitat of many species, protecting the coast from erosion. Fiji With over 330 islands, of which about a third remain uninhabited. One of these is Madriki, the setting for a famous movie about a castaway's adventures. This archipelago, shaped by volcanic fervor, has become a green Eden, nourished by rains that sustain its lush flora. Dubbed the soft coral capital of the world, these marine treasures decorate the island waters. Moreover, there are jungles with trails leading to hidden waterfalls. Siargao, Philippines. The Philippine capital of surfing, influenced by the winds and currents of the Pacific, Famous for its world-class wave, Cloud Nine, attracting surfers from around the globe. Coconut Road is the most spectacular sight. The road is lined with tall coconut trees, creating a natural tunnel. Siargao boasts extensive mangrove forests that serve as natural barriers against tsunamis. Sugba Lagoon, to the west of the island, is a hidden paradise, accessible by boat through a maze of aquatic greenery. Madeira, Portugal. In the North Atlantic, this Portuguese archipelago is adorned with dense Loura Silva forests.
the coast faces an often rough sea, especially in winter. Originating from volcanic activity, the islands display mountainous terrain with fertile soils. Its topography creates various microclimates. It's common for high mountains to be cloudy, contrasting with sunny and clear coastal areas. Walking these paths, one encounters Levadas, a network of irrigation channels akin to aqueducts. Versaska Valley, Switzerland Located in the Italian-speaking part of Switzerland, in the canton of Ticino. For centuries, its inaccessible terrain kept it isolated. It was during the 20th century, with road construction, that the valley became more accessible. The region's traditional architecture is reflected in stone houses and churches. Lavertezzo, known for its two-arched stone bridge, the Ponta dei Solti is one of the most admired spots. Wadi Rum, Jordan. Dubbed the Valley of the Moon, this desert landscape adorns southern Jordan. Reminiscent of Mars, its reddish appearance and desolation render it an extraterrestrial landscape. Characterized by canyons separated by flat valleys, It has been inhabited since prehistoric times by Nabataeans and, more recently, by Bedouins. Khao Sok National Park, Thailand With roots in Earth's history, this park is home to one of the world's oldest rainforests. Containing sedimentary rock dating back over 300 million years. encompassing Chowlan Lake, a huge reservoir created by the Rachaprafa Dam. Flowering Desert, Chile A 
against the canvas of one of the world's most inhospitable places, unfolds an extraordinary natural phenomenon. The Atacama occasionally blooms in an explosion of radiant colors. Various flower species emerge, displaying a fleeting yet fantastic spectacle. Vast expanses of sand and stone are adorned with shades of red, yellow, and lilac. Yellowstone National Park, United States. The world's first national park, established in 1872. Yellowstone Canyon is one of its geological features. Inside are the spectacular Yellowstone Falls. Beneath the park's surface lies a massive supervolcano, responsible for the high geothermal activity. The Grand Prismatic Spring amazes with its color palette. Due to the thermophilic bacteria residing in the mineral-rich waters, Yellowstone hosts one of North America's largest bison populations. Wolves, reintroduced in the 90s, are one of the predators present. They usually hunt in packs, but occasionally alone if they encounter a sick or injured bison. In such instances, a lone wolf can take down its unlucky prey, allowing the pack to join later. Harau Valley, Indonesia Tucked away in the heart of Sumatra, this spot is in a scarcely visited region. Tall sandstone cliffs create the splendid backdrop of the valley. It features a mosaic of fertile agricultural land. Several waterfalls, initially hidden, suddenly reveal themselves among the lush vegetation. St. Petersburg, Russia The 
the Venice of the North, founded by Tsar Peter the Great. Capital of the Russian Empire for over two centuries. During summer, this city experiences white nights where the sun barely sets. The Hermitage, one of the world's largest and oldest museums, was founded by Catherine the Great. The Church of the Savior on Spilled Blood displays a traditional medieval Russian design with colorful, bulbous domes. Cape Town, South Africa Nestled between a mountain range and the Atlantic Ocean waters. Table Mountain is visible from various parts of the city. One of the most renowned, Camps Bay Beach, offers an exceptional view of the Twelve Apostles mountain range. These waters host one of the densest populations of great white sharks globally. The nearby Cape of Good Hope is commonly thought to be Africa's southernmost point. In reality, this title belongs to Cape Agulhas, the meeting point of the Indian and Atlantic Oceans. To the south, at Boulders Beach, there's a colony of African penguins. They're identifiable by their black spot patterns and pink skin areas above their eyes. Venice, Italy Known as the Serenissima, this city stands on wooden piles fixed in the lagoon's mud. Remarkable for the multitude of canals that crisscross it. These canals have been Venice's communication routes for centuries. The Grand Canal stands out in breadth and fame, topping them all. Along its banks, you can see grand palaces and historic buildings.
St. Mark's Square rises in the vibrant city center. This corner hosts St. Mark's Basilica, the Campanelli, and the Doge's Palace. Opposite, the Basilica of San Giorgio Maggiore has captivated artists' gazes. Krakow, Poland Poland's cultural gem on the Vistula River boasts a medieval old town, preserved exemplarily. It was Poland's capital until 1596, maintaining its status as the country's cultural and art epicenter. St. Mary's Basilica in the Market Square is the most important Christian church. Wawel Castle is another highlight within the historic center. Legend has it that a dragon lived in its dungeons, terrorizing citizens, until it was defeated. Seville, Spain The capital of Andalusia, one of the world's flamenco hubs, In the 17th century, it emerged as the global economy's nucleus, driven by its intense trade relations with the Americas. The cathedral, the world's largest Gothic structure, is topped by the Giralda, its bell tower. A short stroll away is the historic Plaza de España, commemorating the 1929 Ibero-American Exposition. Salzburg, Austria The birthplace of Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart The Salzach River bisects it, dividing it into two halves. The geometrically designed Mirabel Gardens were constructed by a prince archbishop for his lover. The beauty of St. Gilgen to the east rivals Salzburg. A village on the shores of Lake Wolfgang Sea, the birthplace of Mozart's mother. Bern, Switzerland. The country's capital, where Einstein formulated his groundbreaking theory of relativity.
situated on a bend in the Ar River. Legend has it, its founder promised to name the city after the first animal he hunted in the forest, which turned out to be a bear. The clock's tower is famous for its hourly automaton show. Kyoto, Japan Intensely embodying the spirit of traditional Japan, serving as Japan's capital from 794 to 1868, it remains the heart of Japanese culture. Throughout this period, thousands of temples were erected. Fushimi Hinari Taisha is the most prominent. Noted for its thousands of red Tori gates that create a winding path through the mountain. Lisbon, Portugal The Portuguese capital is set on seven hills along the coast. Commerce Square served as the city's main maritime entry, welcoming kings for over two centuries. Bellum Tower was built to defend the city and as a departure point for exploration voyages. Located near Lisbon, in Sintra, the Peña Palace has served both as a monastery and a royal residence. Istanbul, Turkey Formerly known as Byzantium and later Constantinople, situated at the crossroads between Europe and Asia. The Sultana Met district is the historic heart of the metropolis. Here, Hagia Sophia marked a turning point in world architecture, originally a church before becoming a mosque. Competing in beauty are the Blue Mosque, one of the few in the world with six minarets, and the Suleymaniyeh Mosque.
Paris, France. The French capital, dubbed the City of Light, for being a center of ideas during the Enlightenment. The Champ de Mars is an immense park leading to the Eiffel Tower, its most recognizable symbol. At the western end of the Champs Elysees, the Arc de Triomphe honors Napoleon Bonaparte's military victories. Notre Dame Cathedral gained fame through the novel The Hunchback of Notre Dame, which tells the tragic story of Quasimodo. On the outskirts of Paris, the former royal French splendor is manifested in the Palace of Versailles, with large gardens and luxurious halls. Rome, Italy Cradle of the Roman Empire, the Eternal City, Italy's capital. With roots dating back over 2,500 years, it's a living museum of Western civilization. Within its boundaries lies Vatican City, the world's smallest state. Home to St. Peter's Basilica. In ancient times, the Colosseum served Romans as an entertainment center with gladiator combats. Love seekers gather at the Trevi Fountain, Rome's most captivating Baroque fountain. Even more splendid is the monument to Victor Emmanuel II, the first monarch of unified Italy. Rio de Janeiro, Brazil Harmonizing urban, mountainous, and coastal elements. Dubbed the Marvelous City. The Christ the Redeemer statue crowning Corcovado Mountain is one of the city's landmarks. Rio also shines for its beautiful beaches, including Copacabana and Ipanema. Prague, Czech Republic Known as the City of a Hundred Spires, or the Mother of Cities. The Vltava River flows through the city, with the Charles Bridge crossing it, linking the Old Town with the Lesser Town. For centuries, the seat of power has been at Prague Castle, the residence of kings and emperors.
Within the castle complex, St. Vitus Cathedral is the Czech Republic's most important sanctuary. Florence, Italy serves as the capital of Tuscany, renowned as the Cradle of the Renaissance. A paradise for art lovers boasting an astonishing concentration of masterpieces. The Duomo, Florence's cathedral, stands out having taken about two centuries to complete. It features a splendid dome, the result of Filippo Brunelleschi's architectural genius. Lucerne, Switzerland A city in central Switzerland with well-preserved medieval architecture. Blending the traditional with the contemporary, featuring churches, wooden bridges, and towers from bygone eras. The Reus River, originating in the Alps, flows through the city, heading north. Over it spans the Chapel Bridge, Europe's oldest covered walkway. Oschenen Lake, Switzerland. Enclosed by mountains like Blumesalp, Oschenenhorn, Frundenhorn, and Doldenhorn, formed by the meltwater from nearby glaciers. Its color ranges from turquoise to cyan, as if a dye had trickled down from the peaks. In winter, the water freezes, making it hard to recognize a lake once lay there. Lavaux Vineyards, Switzerland Along Lake Geneva, these vineyards create one of Switzerland's most stunning cultural landscapes. The views feature rolling terraces, with the blue lake as a backdrop. For generations, Laveau has cultivated wines, producing vintages of exceptional quality. Their origins trace back to the Middle Ages, when Benedictine monks laid the foundation of the terraces.
We've reached the final destination in our quest of the world's most beautiful places. And it's thrilling to think of how many more corners remain unexplored. For now, we bid farewell until our next journey.